Jessica is finally coming home for Christmas. Prodigal sister returns. What's well, been three years? Ouch. But this year, she doesn't want to leave. I want the house. Wait a minute. You want our house? It's sold. A dog? Santa brought me a dog. What she didn't expect. It's Michael's dog. Was him. I wonder where she ended up here. Well, this is going to be her new house. What? You know what? I should, uh, I should get going. I signed an agreement. There's got to be a loophole to be found. Doesn't it say that it's contingent on Michael selling his house? If he doesn't, then Dad can cancel the agreement. She'll have to fight for her dream house. What are you measuring for anyway? To put in a pool. A pool? Take me to your leader. Just about to show them the Beale house. Michael's house. It's a bit of a dump, don't you think? By the way, you were really cute the other day. I wasn't trying to be cute. And find a love. Michael's uh, pretty darn adorable. When's the last time you were on a date? Maybe you need to take him out in the woods like you used to with your other boyfriend. She thought she'd lost long ago. We were nine. We played together all that summer and we didn't give each other our real names. This sounds like a very torrid affair for nine-year-olds. Mar Vista Entertainment presents she was my first best friend. We used an old lunchbox as a time capsule. A collection of memories of the whole summer. A holiday tale. What is that? It's just some uh, old junk from when I was a kid. About coming home. Just try to be here now, this Christmas, with all of us. And discovering love. She looks very pretty, Daddy. Can't argue with you there. All over again. It's you. Andrea Roth. Nicholas Brendan. No matter where you go, you will always be my best friend. A Golden Christmas.